Hey everyone, welcome back to another Terraria video. You know, after I made that Zenith slash Zenith video, I feel like it inspired some people. Because, you know, those items, weapons that we saw in that, they, they weren't the best. Some of them are pretty cool and they stood out from the others. But, you know, they all could have been better. So people are taking their own initiative and they are making a bunch of Zenith slash Zenith type weapons. And as you can see, we got ham axes, we got pickaxes, we got guns again we got bows i don't know why the bow sprite is so tiny can't even see it but when i throw it out it looks a lot cooler and we got spell books so there's probably gonna be more and more zenith type items and weapons that come out in the future but uh for now you know we'll take a handful at a time and we'll check them out but let, let's start with the gun right here because this gun is called zeva summons guns to fight for you the reason why i'm starting with this one it's the same exact thing as the original zenith gun i i, I don't know why I don't know why that shit was loud. Oh my. But there you go. I don't know why it's called Zeva. I, who knows? Okay. Well, there you go. That one's done. But yeah, I'm very interested to check out the tools here because we got a ham axe, we got a pickaxe, and then we have a true pickaxe. So uh, I guess let's see some damage. Okay. Kind of does good damage for a tool. Ham axe only playthrough. And then let's see the pickaxe too. Yeah, pickaxe does good damage. Uh, not as much as the ham axe. I don't know if this is the same creator or same creators that made this. I don't know. They may be like, oh, their materials don't get too excited. As you can see, it's... <laughs> It's kind of weird that uh, there's a material, right? I guess it's just like different orders uh, that you could have crafted in. And it's also a material for the true version. I'm assuming the same thing with the hammocks. No, the hammocks is just under uh, chest harvesters. But yeah, let's see the true ones damage. Okay, nice like 13, 1400. But now let's put them to the actual test here. Let's find some stuff to mine. Glad that I have these giant pieces of dirt right here. And let's see the pickaxe in action. Here are the stats right here. Enable smart cursor to mine quicker right click to mine larger chunks so we're gonna use the smart cursor for obvious reasons come on it says it goes quicker might as well use it oh my god it was so quick i couldn't even stand in the right spot all right here we go beautiful you love to see it maybe i gotta make another best pickaxe in terraria video yeah i, I would consider this definitely good speed for a xena type pickaxe uh What's usually the fastest one in vanilla Minecraft? I don't know. It's usually the drill, the, the laser drill, the pick saw, the claws. But this definitely goes faster than all of those. It is also a modded item. So it's understandable that it would go faster than a vanilla item. But yeah, we have the right click feature here. Let's go ahead and check this out. Boom. Oh my God. So I could just, oh my God. This is amazing. I could literally just start taking chunks out of everything. But now I'm interested to see the true one because the true one's even better. Right click to destroy everything. See, I don't know about that. I, I just reloaded this world after the last video, the uh, Ek Death video. But let's see the just regular left click super fast. I can't even touch the floor. That's how fast it's going. Like it's breaking the floor before I can even touch it. And then let's see the right click. Okay, I don't know what just happened right there. Oh, is it like pulling me forward? So we've seen uh, drills do this before. It's pretty much a drill now. Now drills like the chariot, I believe was one of them or the dragon drill. I don't know, it's been a long time since I've done that drill video. But it's pretty much the same idea here. It's still pretty cool though. Yeah, that was the pickaxes. Let's go ahead and check out the ham axe now. I should have an area for this. Over here, I think this is where I did the hammer video. I'm pretty sure, I, I don't know. It's been a long time since I did it. But yeah, is there any special features here? It's just really good, I'm assuming. Uh, it breaks trees, obviously. Oh my God, yeah, it, it definitely breaks trees. But let's see it against walls. Look at that. ASMR, Terraria, ASMR 3. Did I ever make a third one? I don't remember. But yeah, this this is fast. If you need to take down walls quick, boom, bada bing, right here. Very satisfying wall takedown noise too. But yeah, there you go. There was the ham axe and the pickaxe. I guess we could test it out on a boss real quick, just for the hell of it. Uh, it's gonna be the king slime is the one we're gonna test it out on. And the ham axe. Honestly, I expect to just shred through. And then uh, I'll just use the pickaxe on the remainders, I guess. Well, I don't know. Maybe the pickaxe does do good damage against the king slime. Let's see. Might as well. We're using the true version. Yeah, it still does good damage. Pickaxe only playthrough. 
you'd have to add a lot of pickaxe mods if I were to do a pickaxe only playthrough, but that's just me. You know, I would love some variation in the playthrough. But yeah, there you go. That was the tools. Let's move on to the weapons. Motherfucker, I just broke my testing area. All right, so let us get a Zen and Zenith spellbook. I'm gonna pronounce everything differently every time. So now that we got Zini here in the sprite, uh, I don't know if I used this sprite before. Like, I don't remember what the original bow sprite we saw in the other video was. It looks similar. Yeah, let's go ahead. Let's see it in action here. Well, let's read what it does. Summons bows to fight for you. So, if this is anything, th these two are from the same mod. The Zeva and the Zenny. If these two are anything alike, the bow is going to be exactly like the gun. Let's see. Yes. The answer is yes. Okay. I like it. It's a little loud, but I like it. Love to see it. We got all the beautiful bows behind us. Holy hell, this one is so loud. Uh, the DPS up in the, the 10k, 10,000 area, probably even higher than that. Yep, uh, it looks like it could go way higher. But you love to see it, honestly. Let's move on to the spell book. The spell book I'm interested in because this is a different mod. So we're going to see a different take here. The tale of the ultimate journey. Fire all type of projectiles while charging. Once fully charged, fire a devastating laser. So let me uh, check. Is there a right click for this? Right click for this? No? All right. So we're charging. <laughs> this is charging up a, a spell? I don't know. Oh. Oh my god. Okay. This is pretty cool. Okay, I, I like this one. I like this one. I like both of these. These are very nice. I would definitely consider them better than the weapons, uh, some of the weapons we checked out in the previous uh, zine of the video. But yeah, let's go ahead and test them out on some bosses. That's what we want to see here. Let us go ahead and test the golem. He will be our go to for the first fight. The golem. Zenny, get his ass. Beautiful music to my ears, my slowly deafening ears. Golem again, but this time with the spell book. Okay, we got the laser out. This thing doesn't seem to be doing as much damage. I, I don't know. I'm not wearing armor or accessories for any of these, but like. I don't know, it doesn't seem to do as good damage as the, the Zenny does. But let me put the Zenny up against maybe something harder. Let's do uh, the Jumbo Cactus Man from Juice Mod. Let's see here. Let's see if Zenny does that damage. Okay, it's not bad. Given that this is a post Moon Lord boss. Oh my god, that's so loud. <laughs> post Moon Lord weapon, post Moon Lord boss, alright? Decent damage. Alright, now that we know that does decent damage, we can finish it off with the spell book. We're just trying to get to the laser part. See, I don't know if the laser part is better or not, honestly. I, I don't know. Okay, hold on. Let me put on like a mage outfit. Maybe like it really does need that boost. We're just going to put on the vanilla nebula set. And maybe we'll do more. It looks like we're doing more. Let's see when we get to the laser though. I mean, yeah, it's doing more. It has to do more because we're wearing an armor set. So yeah, maybe that one depends on an armor set a little bit more. Still very cool. Still very cool. I like both of these weapons. The Zenny leaves a lot of arrows everywhere though. But yeah, there you go. There was all the new Zenith Zenith type weapons that I saw in the mod browser. And honestly, I am impressed. Uh, I know the Zeva, I think the code for it was the person who made the original the original Zenith gun. So if you guys are wondering why it's the same attack, pretty sure it's the same person. Uh, they gave him the code. They helped him with the code. Something like that. You can read it in the description of that mod. But yeah, as I said, as more and more of these type items come out, I will be sure to check them out. We're still waiting for a summoner version, like a good summoner version. And we're still waiting for a good armor set, I guess, because the last armor set we checked out wasn't the greatest. Wasn't really that cool. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to follow my Twitch, follow my Twitter, so you know when I'm streaming on twitch and i got the game raider socials coming soon don't worry and also i promised this a while ago i'm finally gonna play my new keyboard noises and i guess show a picture of it too why not uh because i promised that a while ago and i never got around to it but yeah hope you guys enjoyed see you later enjoy the keyboard noises